taking, and I'm going to talk to you about these, the new compressor that we have. First of all, here's our old compressor. We've been making this for about 15 years. This is the VET2. This is an all discrete Class A compressor with step switches. This is the new one. It's called the VET3. The difference between this one and the old one is that it has it's transformerless and it has pots instead of switches. So some people are always going to want the switches because they're always repeatable. The other people are going to say, oh, but I'd like to be able to get in between the positions. This one also has two new features. It has continuously variable stereo linking so that you can be fully independent left and right or you can have stereo linking anywhere in between. This one also has high pass filters on the peak detectors, which means that if you have wide band program material like a stereo mix where there's a lot of bass content and it's messing with your upper frequencies like your vocals, you can filter out the low end with the peak detector so that it doesn't mess with the high end. That's something you can't do in the old one. So they're similar products, but different in a lot of ways. Some people are always going to want the old one, and some people are going to like this new one.